Uh, good morning. This is Miss McPhee, and it is Thursday, November 13th. I'm here, or 14th. I'm here with fourth period. Say hello, fourth period. Hi. All right. So last week, fifth period made the video. This week, fourth period's making the video. This is our homework that's due tomorrow, Friday, November 15th. It is front and back. Make sure you do all parts of the problems. And we are looking specifically this week at using the double number line. I did go to our shoe box. We did have a suggestion. It said number one, the trains. So we'll do this first problem together, okay? Two trains are traveling at constant speeds on different tracks. So we have train A, its distance traveled and time. And we have train B, its distance traveled and time. And the question is we want to answer which train is traveling faster. So let's look at the information we have. Um, I might want to start here because there's less intervals and I'm starting with four seconds is a hundred meters. So two seconds would be how many meters? Alexis. 50. Very good. We're dividing both values by two which means that one second the train travels how far? Junior? 24. Very good. So train B is traveling 25 meters in one second. What do we know already about train A? Already there. What do we know? Oh, that's our bell for seventh grade lunch. What do you know about train A? It's for YouTube. Don't you want to say your answer? Um, Aiden, what do you want to say? Um, guess. Do you need to guess? I feel like we have this really key piece of information right here. Oh, that. Yeah, that. Yeah, in one second is how much? 12.5. Okay, so train A traveled 12 and a half meters in one second. So let's use that data to answer this question. Who's traveling faster? Rohan? Train. Okay, so train B is part of the answer. You can give me a good reason why. Alana? travels half the distance. Very good. How does Alana know that train A travels half the distance in one second? Where'd that half come from? That's a great piece of information. Alexis? Yeah, half of 25 is 12 and a half. Very good. All right, so if you wanted to finish the double number line, you could, but you don't have to. You found all your pieces of information. Make sure you do on your own. Question 10 for lesson 10 and question for lesson 8. And then this is a new piece I have for you. Just what do you want to learn more about? Any suggestions for things you want us to revisit? You can write that down there. All right. Have a great day. Say goodbye, fourth period. Bye. Bye. Oh, and our bell rang. Did you hear that?